A serial killer is possibly behind a series of homicides in California. A desperate search now underway for the person or possibly even people responsible for killing six men and wounding one woman. The Stockton Police Department released this surveillance video of a person of interest here dressed in black clothes who appeared to be at multiple crime scenes. The killings date back to last year, with the most recent homicide taking place last week. National correspondent James Packard has been following this story for us. He's live in Los Angeles. James, what more do we know about this tonight? Well, Julie, now police have linked another killing as far back as last year to these other five that have occurred in Stockton. And they've now actually talked to someone who survived an attack by what they believe is the same person who is showing up at these other crime scenes. They are now willing to pay a lot of money for information that helps them find this person. Brand new video of a person of interest in what could be serial killings in Stockton, California, seen walking away from the camera, dressed in dark clothing, but showing the person's gait, perhaps critical context for a public now being asked to provide clues. We haven't seen this individual committing a criminal act, but seems to be showing up in some of our recent homicides. So it's a person that we definitely want identified. Police are now offering a six-figure reward for information about the person. That's not very, very uh, easy to identify the person from that one video. Um, but if you have video, if you have a weapon, if you have uh, forensic evidence like fingerprints or DNA, those are all very useful to show that you have a serial killer. Otherwise, uh, uh, you know, uh, you're, you're guessing that it's the same um, person. Now, investigators have connected at least one more death in Oakland last year to five others since July in Stockton, about 70 miles away. We do be believe we could have potential uh, serial killer. A single survivor told police the person is a man, about 5'10 to 6 feet tall, wearing a dark hoodie, dark pants, and a medical face mask. This is very, very concerning. The mayor of Stockton pleading with the public for information. The most important thing is, is to bring justice for these families. Six families grieving a loved one. My mother and father were just heartbroken from this. You know, that's the first baby boy, and, and I know they have so many memories of, uh, you know, of him. As police try to stop a killer they describe as on a mission. Now, police are asking for information from wherever they can get it. People who have information they think might be helpful can report it via the phone, via Crime Stoppers, and you can do that anonymously, Julie. So if anybody's worried about repercussions from that, police are trying to assure the public they would be safe even if they report information. Yeah, hopefully that video will help. Someone will know something out there. Newsies, James Packard. Thanks for that. Reporting from Los Angeles tonight.